there's the bell. He's simply reminding him that he's here. He may have to worry about internal injuries. As we watch Sheamus, let's get your take on him. Definitely looking good so far. Hasn't taken too much punishment up to this point. And he brings the action back inside the ring. Yeah, I, I, I think this is good strategy. Whoa, and a bit of a test of strength here. I love it. This is a good old-fashioned battle of power versus power. Sheamus is one of my favorite WWE success stories. If you look closely, you can find him as a part of security detail in WWE television segments during its European shows. He then relocated to the United States and trained in WWE's developmental system before blasting his way onto the WWE's main roster. Whoa, whoa, whoa! So damaging. And the taunting continues. And now he goes for it a second time. A quick reversal by Sheamus. That's a textbook maneuver. And that's patented Michael Cole. Cole, Sheamus' story on how he got into WWE is awesome. I mean, from his cameo appearance on WWE programming to tryout matches, Sheamus showed the potential to become a top WWE superstar. And it wasn't long after that, Sheamus locked horns with the game Triple H at WrestleMania 26. The power of Sheamus dominating the early going. stories that embody what WWE is all about. Superstars and divas chasing their dreams to entertain the fans. You talked about Sheamus' match versus Triple H at WrestleMania 26, and what's even more amazing about that is one year before at WrestleMania 25, Sheamus was part of the ring crew setting up for WWE's annual spectacular. Man, just think of how unbelievable that is, Michael. One year you're helping put up the ring at WrestleMania, and the next year you're in a match against the King of Kings, Triple H. I mean, the journey that Sheamus made to WWE and to stardom is the type that could only be made by a warrior, a Celtic warrior. Wearing down the opposition here. Whoa. One of these guys is going to walk away with the win here tonight. I just can't imagine one of them also accepting defeat. Oh, looking to pick up three. The great white Sheamus is as rough and tough as they come. He brings an inner grit from the streets of his home, Dublin, Ireland, that has translated to amazing success here in WWE. Sheamus has never backed down from a fight in his life, and he's not going to start now. Well, you don't get a moniker like the Celtic Warrior by taking fights that are easy victories. Michael, the intensity that Sheamus brings to every match is something you can feel from the moment he enters the arena. And trust me, it's something his opponents feel when that bell rings. Neutralizer! Finisher! This match might be over. This could do it. Maybe it's two. King, we've talked about the fire inside Sheamus along with the power and intensity he brings to the ring with him every night. He likes to do things within the guidelines of the WWE rulebook, but if an opponent decides to go in a different direction, he can certainly fight fire with fire. 
With this kind of attack, you have to wonder just how much longer they can compete in this match. Yeah, I completely agree. The way things... Hoping ended early. Here's hoping. Sheamus finding a path of destruction currently. Cesaro with nice contact there. Well, you said it, Cole. Listen, Sheamus is looking for tears to cover. Two. Cesaro coming up with the power to move this match in his favor. Sheamus turns it around. <laughs> For a big guy, Sheamus sure is sneaky. Somehow, he's kicked it into another gear here tonight. What a move! What a smart move! Reversal! Cesaro showing his prowess. The tour of that, and he's not going to last long. It is so hard to stop that kind of strength. It's nearly impossible to deal with this type of power. Cesaro, he's looking to end it here. Call your friends, let them know with a swing. OMG, this is awesome. Man, he's still down after that move. Hey, this may very well be it. Two. Oh, going to the top. High risk. Look out! What an offensive show by Cesaro. His shoulders are down. So many great names entered into this tournament, but in the end, there will only be one left standing as the winner. There's the suplex. That was nice. It only takes a couple of those to bring his... The shoulders are down. Cesaro is one of the most... It's over. It's all over. Here's your winner. Nicely done. He picks up the win. Few things are more rewarding than the feeling of keeping your opponent's shoulders down for the three count.